the president of Harvard University, recently said, the world today is longing for a creed to believe and a song to sing. The creed we believe to be Jesus Christ and him crucified and raised again. And the song we believe is the song of salvation. And I sincerely believe that if the world tonight would turn in repentance of their sins and faith in Jesus Christ, we could have not only individual peace, but world peace. And I sincerely believe that if the world should turn to Christ tonight, the whole world would start singing a new song. We would have a flag to follow. We would have a creed to believe in. We would have a song to sing. When that group of disciples met that day at Pentecost, and they were gathered in one accord, the fire fell, the wind blew, and we're praying tonight that the fires of spiritual revival that are part of the warp and woof of this great nation of Scotland will once again burn and will be scattered by the wind of God's Holy Spirit until every life and every home is touched in Scotland and until every social problem has felt the impact of spiritual revival. And in this little nation of yours of only five million, it's going to take devotion and consecration. I want you to bring your Bibles every night because I'm going to open the Bible every night. I haven't come to... say that then you can say with Paul in the midst of the storms of life I believe God you can go home with a new song in your heart tonight you can go home with a new commitment and a new transformation in your life tonight by giving your heart and your life to him every head bowed and every eye closed for prayer no one